the best free project management software 2024. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about one of the best free project management softwares in 2024. So there's quite a lot of project management softwares out there, but I'm gonna be talking about five of them, okay? And then in the end, I'm gonna be telling you the top, you know, top most used and the one that I prefer off of, you know, all the other ones that I talked about. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So to start things off, we are going to talk about ClickUp. So the one and only, you know, very incredible software called ClickUp. ClickUp, one app to replace them all, okay? And it's a pretty incredible app. It gives you all the different products when it comes to project management. Uh, you can assign tasks, documents, goals, chat around. It has a great dashboard view. And it has different types of views, okay? Mainly people use the list view for ClickUps, but you can use different views for it as well. But as I said, mainly it is used for list views. Other views like calendar views and uh, stuff are present as well. But it is good, but there's a reason that I kept it at the bottom of our list, okay? So yeah, that's ClickUp. And obviously it works with a lot of other providers as well, like Fortinet, Logitech, Booking.com, IBM, TIBC, Spotify, Netflix. T-Mobile, you know, all these big companies, and they also have pretty incredible reviews about themselves. So, you know, uh, we have a pretty good idea of how all this works. Now, moving on, once we have, you know, actually discussed ClickUp, let's move on to Jira or Jira, you know, however you like to pronounce it. So Jira is a very incredible software, and it's specifically made for your project management. Now Jira is specifically created by the people at Atlassian. And if I were to give you an overview of Jira, you can, you're can you gonna be able to see that Jira has everything, you know? And a lot of people actually call it the number one, you know, management program. I would obviously disagree, but Jira is pretty good. You know, a suite of agile work management solutions that powers collaboration across all teams. Jira has a very good outlook to it. You know, it has a very good user-friendly interface. There's no pricings on it. It's totally free. Obviously, you can go for the upper plans. Those will give you more features and more things to work with. But the free plan is pretty incredible as well. It works just like your basic Notion tab if you've used Notion. It's very good for your project management. You can assign tasks, documents, again, the same way. And it has a lot of views okay tons and tons of views like there's a lot of emphasis on view like you can get summary board list calendar timeline any view that you fancy you are gonna find it in Jira it's absolutely incredible and it truly blows my mind on how many things Jira actually provides us so yeah uh that's the basic idea of Jira now moving on from Jira Let's go ahead and talk about another incredible software. So this software for project management is called Basecamp. It's, as I said, a great base, you know, project management software. It's great for online collaboration, great for teams, and the features that Basecamp provides you is pretty incredible. It's really good for teams. Like if you're an individual trying to assign your tasks around, I wouldn't exactly recommend Basecamp to you because it's not, you know, exactly the you could say team, uh, the individual work type. It's more of a teamwork software. And yeah, if you do have a team, then I would definitely tell you to use this incredible software. But if you're not working with a team, then I would definitely tell you to use the ones that I'm going to tell you after Basecamp. So Basecamp gives you all these features, not everything under done, just the stuff to get it done. So essentially project management's greatest hit. It's simplified, refined, and integrated in, and organized. It's the best software out there for teams, in my opinion. And, you know, you can organize at home, stay on top with messages, track work with to-dos, schedule, chat, store, share, and discuss, automatically check in on regular, which is basically your automations, workflows for, you know, your sales funnels and all. You get clear views, again, pretty incredible views, likable collaborate seamlessly open a door to the world you can ping people you have great charts you can hook it up with clouds a cloud software pretty good as well 
You can get all the statistics and analytics and latest activities and a whole lot more. So, you know, Basecamp, very incredible, very nice software. I would definitely recommend users out there to start using this pretty nice software. And uh, obviously, if you're working as an individual, not the best, but if you have a team, I would definitely give you a go and green light for Basecamp. Although the next one that we're going to be discussing is a very popular one when it comes to your, you know, management. So this one's called Trello, and this is one of the best team management softwares out there, for me at least. It's the best for project management. And as you can see, I myself have a lot of workflows going on in Trello. Now, the reason for that is because Trello is an out of this world software and the amount of people that use Trello is absolutely crazy. And they use it for good reason, you know, because Trello, you know, truly brings out so much from your, you know, pages and from how your projects are actually supposed to work. It brings so much out of that that there is no way that you can't use these softwares. Like these softwares are really good. They're really well worked with, really well integrated. And uh, I would definitely recommend the users out there to use this platform. Now, obviously Trello has its, uh, you know, disadvantages. So if I click on create and I'm going to create a project management board over here. Okay. So once you create a board, I'm going to show you what it looks like. So this is what a basic board is going to look like. As you can see, I have uh, created a list over here. I'm just going to go ahead and archive that. So you can add a list, enter a name, and then in this, you can add cards. But as you can see in the Trello board, you don't have a lot of views on the free plan. So you are going to need to upgrade. And even when it's upgraded, you don't get a lot of views. It mainly gives you the Kanban view. So that's why I kept it at number two, even though the user accessibility and ease of use is out of this world, but Trello still needs to be at a number two. So the big number one spot goes to Asana. Yeah, a lot of you were probably waiting for this one because Asana is the number one most used software out there. And in my opinion, one of the best in the game. The project management skills that you get on Asana are out of this world. And it's so easy to use. It's so fun to use. And it's definitely one of the greatest things out there when it comes to project management. So the features give it all. You get intelligence, which is basically your AI, calendar view, forums, automations, app integrations, workflow builder, timeline, reporting, workload, goals, boards, anything you want you get it in Asana. And the app integrations, let me tell you, you get any type of app with any and every type of feature that you get. And it's so incredible. It's so fun to use. And most of the people that I know have been using Asana. Like, obviously, a lot of people use Trello, as I stated, but most of the people I know when it comes to the work and business side of things use Asana because Asana is very incredible. It's very easy. It's very fun. And the ease of use, oh, it's visible. It's literally physically visible. So yeah, those are the best free project management softwares for 2024. Now, if you enjoyed watching this video, drop down a like, subscribe to the channel, and let me know down in the comments which one you think is best for you. So that's pretty much about it for this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all of you next time. Goodbye.